In primetime news this evening, entertainer Vibes Cartel awaiting verdict in Privy Council appeal. Relatives of man accused in contract killing of paralegal insist he's innocent. And later, government tables $1.3 trillion budget for 2024-25 fiscal year. Good evening and welcome to Primetime News. A special welcome if you're watching online at onespotmedia.com or on TVJ International in the Cayman Islands. I'm Herman Green. And I am Andrea Chisholm. With a preview of what's to come in business news, here's Javon Keys. Well, Andrea, the private sector organization of Jamaica PSOJ has outlined its priority areas for advocacy this year. And guess what? The skills gap is a major one. So I'll have the details about the concern they have regarding bringing in labor and the process to do so. Okay, and Spencer Darlington is also here with a preview of what's to come in sports. Spencer? Thank you, Herman. Well, despite a century from one of their opening batters, the Jamaica Scorpions are still facing a deficit against CCC in their West Indies Championship second round match. We'll have more details on that in primetime sports later. Thank you, Spencer. There's also sports commentary E-Prime and weather in this newscast. But before we hear about all that, let's head over to Romain Robinson to tell us what's coming up in the weather. Thank you, Andrea. Now, we are expecting much of the rest of this week to be fairly dry, but some rain is expected at the start of next week. All right, and we also have our feedback question. Our question this evening is, what are your expectations of the first local government debates scheduled for tonight? Share comments online, facebook.com slash television Jamaica, and post on X at TVJ News Center. Please stay tuned. Primetime News returns after this break.